Hi guys, today I'm here with Danny Shaw, who's my best friend right now. Uh -huh. <laughs> He's my photographer. Well, basically, there's a website called Purpleport, and we met through Purpleport, and we met through friends as well. And um, yeah, basically, they do photo shoots on Purpleport about models, and you can basically model or be a photographer if you like on Purpleport. You just need to sign up, and yeah, that's how we met. <laughs> and we did a photo shoot together. Hi hey everyone, I'm Danny. You can check out my work in the links below. And um, yeah, here's to talk a bit about photography and modeling. Yeah, <laughs> awesome. Purport is a model portfolio site for photographers and models. Um, I mainly only use it for the calendar, but you can use it to meet models and photographers and get paid work through there. Yeah. Um, but I design and shoot motorbikes for a living and I've been doing model portfolios for 10 years. Wow, that's amazing. 10 years, I've only been doing it a couple years, but yeah. I've had some really good experiences with photographers from Purpleport, but I've also had some negative experiences. Like once I went to the story, basically, right, I went to this photo shoot and like they were all prepared, I brought all my dresses, all that, I was sitting down and this girl was doing my hair and she backcombed my hair really badly and made it look a huge mess and then I got started to get a panic attack and I left. Oh god. Yeah, it was crazy. I can't believe that actually happened to me from Purple Port but there have been really good experiences like I've had a couple photographers that I like see often and that I hang out with like Danny Shaw which is awesome. So you can meet some amazing <laughs> photographers from Purple Port. <laughs> Tell me a bit more about your modelling experiences. Uh, it's been a long journey, long journey. So You've met a lot of models. I think I've shot about 600. Oh my gosh, 600 <laughs> models. See, this guy is a professional. <laughs> He's been doing so many. I have not done that many, seriously, compared to that. I wish I had done that many. But, um, it takes ages. Started working in nightclubs and festivals. And then after that, so you make connections through nightclubs and stuff. By the age of 20, I opened my own photography studio straight away. Um, and that lasted about eight months or so. And then I had 14 photographers working for me in nightclubs, which we trained up. Um, so that was pretty good. Um, and then done university. Surprisingly failed photography twice. <laughs> you failed photography, but now you're a photographer and yeah. you're winning at life now. And now I have the students from that university asked to be my apprentices and tag along and oh. shoots to learn. Oh my gosh, it's so crazy. It's quite tempting to email the tutors saying you failed me, but I've got your students. Asking <laughs> I'm to be winning. On my shoot. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I've got them all. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's been a rough journey. Like when I started, I wasn't getting any money for shoots. Yeah. And I was living on my friends' sofas while they, like, they fed me because I didn't earn enough money. Oh. So I was practice and practice and practice, and then yeah, ten years later, I'm now fully booked for the next four and a half months. That's crazy. That's amazing. I wish I was fully booked for the past. <laughs> Like a few months, yeah. But that's basically our um, purple port experiences. Um, I have a best friend called Alicia and Nicole, and they do purple port as well. They are the ones that showed me that website actually, and it's really cool to see their pictures too. That's how we met, isn't it? Yeah, that's how. Well, I met Alicia from like uh, like you now meetups and stuff. Which is like a live stream website. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's really good. I love you now so much. <laughs> you have to be careful when looking for photographers though, because you have to look at their yeah. references and stuff. Yeah, definitely. They're all usually middle aged fat men. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so you have to be careful what photographers that you do get because you want to be careful like who you end up like getting photos with and who's taking photos of you. It's, it's important that they're a nice person, like Danny. I try. I try. <laughs> yeah, he's a very cool person. <laughs> Is there anything more that we can say about Purple You just upload your pictures onto the website and it's your portfolio basically. People can reference you after the photo shoot. If they think that you've had like a good photo shoot, they'll put a good reference for you. And that's really good to, to like see if the photographers are legit. You look at the references. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, remember to give us a thumbs up because it helps us out a lot. And also remember to subscribe for weekly videos every single Thursday because I upload every single week. And click the bell next to the subscribe button to be notified every single time I upload a YouTube video. And, and yeah. If, and if she lets me, I'll put my website link below. Yes, <laughs> his website link will be below and you can check him out guys. Okay, awesome, I love you, bye.